Well, Minnesota's next state flag is off to the legislature. Their final meeting, the state emblems redesign commission drafted their report on the new flag and the new state seal. KTTC's Quinn Gorham explains where things go now. Signed, sealed, and soon to be delivered, the Minnesota State Emblems Redesign Commission has finally completed their goal to redesign the state flag and state seal just four days before their end of the year deadline. Members of the commission met virtually in their final meeting to finalize their report to the legislature. It includes a recap of the 15 meetings the commission held. The commission acknowledged immense public interest. According to the report, their website was visited nearly 240,000 times. After some final discussion, the 34-page report was sent off to be printed. We will work with uh, elected officials, governor's office, and legislative leaders uh, to uh, figure out how they would like to mark the occasion of May 11th. Um, the effective date of the new flag and seal uh, if no further action is taken by the legislature. Interestingly, the flag was originally going to have a name, the Star of the North flag. Ultimately, that name was taken out of the report entirely to avoid confusion with the popular North Star flag movement. Here's what lies ahead. The report will hopefully be printed and sent out by Friday. Then in February, the legislature will have a chance to review the new designs. The DFL is unlikely to have any concessions, being that they're the ones that started this redesign process in the first place, but Republicans may push back just a little bit. They've been saying they don't think that Minnesotans were involved in the process enough and want to put this up to an official state vote. Reporting in St. Paul, I'm Quinn Gorham. If uh, there are no vetoes from state lawmakers, the new flag and seal will be used for the first time May 11th, Minnesota's Statehood Day.